In Affinity Photo, you can erase all the way back to a transparent background by using shapes. So I'm just going to go over here and select a shape. So Star Tool, create that. Once you've done that, go to the Layers panel and you've got Blending Modes. Just go down all the way down to the bottom to Erase and you'll notice I've got two layers. It erases all the way back to that transparency. But what if you want to blur it as well? Make certain the layer is selected, then go to Layer and down to New Layer Filter Layer and Blur and Gaussian Blur. With zero, you can't see anything. Set it to about nine or 10. So just drag and you can now see you've got this lovely blurred star design. You can close the panel and you can see if you go over here to the layers, you can expand it out. You've got the star and you've got the Gaussian Blur. If you want to change the Gaussian Blur, just double click, you bring up the panel again. You can modify the settings. If you want to modify the star, go to the star, select that. Go along here, the control bar, and just change it. So just change it to 9 or 10, as well as using the other settings such as outer circle and inner circle. This is also the same for other shapes. With the star selected, you can go to layer and down here to merge visible to create a pixel layer with that transparency. So at this point, go to the move tool and you can drag and you can see now you've got a nice cut through to the background.